Welcome back to Sped Too Much Diecast. What's going on, crew? Welcome back to the channel, to all you crew members out there. If you're new here to the channel, welcome to Spend Too Much Diecast. All right, so this one, we are continuing our series on opening one of every vehicle, um, just so I can do a little bit of a showcase and get my stuff unboxed and into my display cases. Somebody did mention that they wanted to see this one, so I decided to go ahead and do this one next. Um, to my understanding is I only have two more of the Honda ones we have to unbox. We have the Honda S2000, and then we have another version of the Civic, and then Hondas will be done, and we can move on to a, another type of vehicle. Um, like I said before in another video, I did not put up all the videos of the cars. Um, like, I didn't do the Odysseys, or the um, Honda Super Club, which is a new motorcycle for this year. I didn't put up the N600s, but if you go check out our Facebook page, it'll have all the albums there for you, just because those cars are only like three or four. So there's no point in doing a whole video on that. So this is what we're gonna do today. This is gonna be the Honda Civic Si, and this generation is the sixth generation of the Civic. Um, it varies from years from I think 96 to 2000 is the generation year usually these SIs are 99 or 2000 so they don't really put a year on the casting so there are some that I am missing so as of right now this is it's, it's a mess out here but I kind of got it in order of how they were released and it basically starts with this one here I'm missing another variation. The, the, the earlier variations, they had, um, a lot of them had two different style wheels. So we're gonna start there. And all these will be on the turntable with the voiceover like usual, explaining everything. But we have that one there. There was a wheel variation. I'm missing one. We have that one, the blue one. There's a wheel variation of that one. Then there's that one. And then I think I'm missing one or two. Then there's that one back there. And they're saying there's supposed to be like three different versions of it but one of them's like a lighter blue and they all look the same to me, so I'm not sure. Then we came out with this one and then that one there is super rare. There's another version of that. We have some more here, there, here, going through. And then this one here is the start of the new casting. So they redid the casting, I believe, with that one, this one, and then this was the latest one and then we are gonna see one here in the new year. So I'm not exactly sure what the difference is in the casting. I think it's basically just the, um, the spoiler because everything else looks to be the same. I think the only difference is they, they redid the spoiler because it's still got the same. Um, this is actually a Wings West body kit that they have on it. And it seems like all of them have it. So, and then I do have some bonuses over here that weren't even um, in the checklist. And then Hot Wheels also made the same Honda Civic in a 118th scale, which is pretty big. And I have all of those except for I think I'm missing one of them. So, so we're gonna go ahead and get these things unboxed. We'll throw them on the turntable for you guys and hopefully I can explain everything for you. Alrighty, let's start it off in 2001. We see it from the first edition and this one has the PR5s for the wheels. and this is the second version of it the casting is the same only difference is this one has the LW wheels And the 
third casting of this vehicle comes from 2001 and this was the Toronto's Blue Jays promo car. to the fourth version of this vehicle coming from 2002 part of the tuner series this one has the three sp wheels Number five of the series. This one is the same casting as the one we just saw before from the tuner series, but this one has the five dot wheels. The sixth version of this casting comes from 2002 and this one was a main line version. and we're on to number seven this one again from 2002 this was a pops garage four car set which i believe was a target exclusive Number eight, we are now in 2003, and this was the Fantastic Sam's promotion car. one is number 9, 10, and 11. You'll see it in the next picture, but basically there is three versions of this. This is from 2003 Super Street. This one has real riders and comes in the dark blue. The picture might be hard to see, but basically these are the three versions. The first one is a lighter blue. The second one is a darker blue. That's the one I had on the turntable before this picture. And then the third one is the same dark blue, only has the CP6 wheels. Now we're jumping still in 2003. This one was a AutoZone 2-pack exclusive. So only found in AutoZone with the Civic and then it came with a, another car underneath it. in 2003 
2003. This one is from the Pride Ride series. Now we're in 2005 and this one came from a five pack which was called Dual Cool. Basically each vehicle in this five pack had two different colors, one on each side of the vehicle. And then this was the second version of the dual cool five pack where they all had graphics instead of the double paint job. And again from 2005, this one was a Walgreens battery exclusive. I believe it was put out by Duracell. You got a pack of batteries and then this vehicle was with the batteries. Now we're into 2006. This was part of the Easter Egg Exclusives, which was a Walmart exclusive series. Now into 2007, this one was part of the gift card series, which was a Walmart exclusives. And this one actually does have the older style real rider tires on it. Skipping a few years, we are now into 2010, and this one was from the Mystery Car Series. And this was before we saw it in the bags like they do now. This one was a blister pack, with the blister pack being black, so you cannot see what vehicle you got. Two years later, 2012, we now see it in the Boulevard Big Hits, and again this one is the metal on metal with the real riders. Next year, 2013, we have it from the Jukebox Hip Hop series. following year 2014 we see it in a five pack which was the police pursuit
jumping ahead four years now, 2018, we saw it in the Honda 70th anniversary set. Now we're into 2021. They have updated the tooling. I believe the spoiler is different and they are now putting the plastic for the sunroof. But this one is from the mainline version, Factory Fresh. Here is the second color for the 2021 mainline factory fresh in this nice black. This one is from 2022. We see it in the Honda Civic set. We should be seeing a new casting in 2023, part of the Ultra Hots. Otherwise, this is all the castings that they have made throughout the years. Now, let's check out some bonus cars. So this one is from 2021. This one came in the McDonald's Happy Meal. They had a bunch of different ones. The car was a solid color. And then you would have stickers to put on it for the graphics. Now these here are pretty special. They are from 2002. They are the Super Street Magazine two car set. So it came with this vehicle and another one. They're a little bit smaller than a Hot Wheel car, but they do have very good detail, opening hood, real riders, a pretty cool casting. This was the second coloring of it, again from the Super Street Magazine two car set. I believe this one was partnered up with a Ford Focus from the Super Street Magazine. And this one is the same casting as the last two. This one is from 2003 when Hot Wheels did a 100% Hot Wheels, which basically made the vehicles more realistic. Opening hoods, real riders, and of course that extra detail. And this is just an extra bonus. They also did make the Honda Civic Si as a 118th scale for Hot Wheels. This is just one of the versions. They made them in all different colors and some of them you were even able to put different bumpers on, spoilers on, wheels. So that is pretty cool. I do have a bunch of these models. This will probably be for a later video. I'll do some showcasing on these. Thanks for watching another video from Spent Too Much Diecast. If you will, hit that like button, 
and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Also, check out our Facebook page where there are more pictures and information on the vehicle that you have just seen. And also, on the right here, you'll see some more videos from our channel. Thanks again, everybody, and have a great day.